Short skirts and revealing tops, they've become staples for teen Halloween costumes. But some say they're getting sexier and sexier, and parents need to know where to stop. CW33's Giselle Phelps is here with what they're saying. Giselle. Yeah, Walt and Amanda, lots of parents are being faced with a tough decision this coming week. Just how sexy should you let your teenager dress for Halloween? Halloween costumes for young girls these days have gotten so sexy, they're scaring some parents. A lot of the prepackaged items that are coming out today are targeted toward that more sexual flair of a costume. Twelve-year-old Quincy Lynch had her eye on a packaged pirate getup. I just like the pirateness, I guess. I don't know. Her mom says she tries to shoo her away from the sexier stuff. Yeah, you kind of have to actually steer them away sometimes from aisles with things that aren't very age-appropriate. Amy Ziccarelli is a parenting expert with Kidville who says costumes for those under 18 got sassier as Halloween became more popular among adults. They go out and they get really fun costumes that tend to be on the sexy side. Well, that has trickled down into our teenagers. This year, sexy rapper Nicki Minaj is topping Google's list of most searched costumes. Outfits for other scantily clad pop stars are hits among teens, too. I just saw the Lady Gaga glasses and the wig, so that might be fun. Something different. <laughs> Not too sexy. I mean, I think some of them are a little inappropriate, but it just depends on what it is. The owner of Costume World in Dallas says she tries not to stock teen costumes she thinks cross the line. We want the, the young girls to look cute and enjoy their costume, but we also want to cover them up. Ziccarelli says parents should be shopping for costumes with their teens to make sure certain standards are set. At Halloween, it's you know, it's very important for parents to be able to put their foot down and set boundaries. It's a strategy that seems to have worked for Quincy Lynch. I have a Winnie the Pooh costume at home, so I think I'm going to do that. Winnie the Pooh seems pretty age-appropriate, if you ask me. Now, Ziccarelli says if you make a costume with your own pieces at home, it can be easier to avoid being sexy than if you just go out and buy one that comes in a package. Live in the studio, Giselle Phelps, CW33 News.